Tyson Fury's promoter Frank Warren says the Britain's mooted rematch against Deontay Wilder is likely to take place in the United States in the first half of this year. Wilder retained his WBC heavyweight title following a controversial draw in Los Angeles in December, with many observers insisting Fury had done enough to get the nod from the judges despite being knocked down twice. Fury's compatriot Anthony Joshua, holder of the remaining three major world belts in boxing's blue ribbon division, has been linked with a bout against either of the pair when he returns to action at Wembley on April 13. But the WBA, IBF and WBO heavyweight champion is set to be left out in the cold again, according to Warren, who has resigned to his charge having to fight in America again. We're trying to make that fight at the moment, everyone wants the fight and most importantly the fighters want it, Warren told ESPN. The venue is looking like the US, that's where the money is. Tyson was disappointed with a judging with the last fight, as I was, so a lot of things need to be sorted, but the US is where they want it, probably in the second quarter. Vegas would be one of the options. I wouldn't want to go back to California, I didn't like working with the Californian Commission and there were a lot of things we didn't like there. Tyson is already in the gym working hard, taking over, and I think we would get it the fight versus Wilder, before June, Warren believes Fury's willingness to travel to a champion's backyard is in stark contrast to Joshua, who has never before fought outside of Britain in his 22-fight professional career. We're not complicated, Tyson is the most uncomplicated person you will meet, and he will fight anyone, Warren added. He went to Germany to fight Vladimir Klitschko and he went to America to fight Wilder. It's Joshua's promoters Barry and Eddie Hearn's agenda that complicates it. Joshua is their cash cow and they want to keep milking it.